I'm sick. I'm under the weather. And good thing I have an umbrella, because that, that's perfect for me right now. I just, I need the cold. Okay. <laughs> I'm doing good with Ariel. Don't want to fuck that up. Things are going well. I'm sick. Need to play it cool. Don't overtell her my emotions. Just don't be like, you know, I just, I think you're wonderful and I want to love you forever. Don't tell her that. That's, that's when you fuck up. When you start telling women that too early, you're just in trouble. You're in Fuckville, and guess who's in control of Fuckville? The woman. You want to be in control of Fuckville. Fuckville is, metaphorically speaking, literally sex, and also emotions. You want to be in control of Fuckville. Internet, listen to that advice. If you're not in control of Fuckville, oh, you're going to have a bad, bad relationship. You know what? Women look for two things. They look for a dominant man, and they look for a sensitive man. So you got to play both your cards right. you got to be able to play the whole, oh, I'm so sensitive and unique and individualistic, and I love you, and my feelings hurt. And also the whole, you fucking mean nothing to me, bitch. So you got to be able to play both those roles. Because if you can't, you're going to get walked over. And your feelings are going to get hurt. True story, based on true facts, based on my life. And that's how we're going to lead it. Or, or your roommate is your girlfriend. And then you just fucking, you just date and you come home and then she's there anyway. Although, problem being currently, I don't know how I'm going to go to sleep. I'm going to have to buy some beds. Um, unless, of course, the ladies are going to sleep together. Oh, hey! Hey, uh, roommate stuff. Convince roommate to make meal fix broken out. Maybe I can mooch off one of the other roommates. Yeah, that'd be good. It's, uh, oh, I should probably, should probably, uh, probably greet her. I should say hello or something. I don't even know her name. She's just been living in my house. Uh, which is cool and everything, but, you know. I do not want to pillow fight her, by the way. Hey, yeah, we could totally use another bed in here. All right. We gotta start selling some of our fucking house. Uh, Cause it's not fair that I have roommates and I can't even fucking afford them. Alright, so I guess we'll sell that. And our fucking nice little plant we bought will sell. Um, I guess we could sell the plant condo. Do we really need a, a desk? Well, I guess not. Now where the hell are we gonna put the beds? There's some cheap beds. Oh, this is kind of cheap. Yeah. Oh, we can't do the sleeping bag. Yeah, it's totally roommate shit. Oh, we can have like a fucking slumber party. Yeah, I fucking love that. Yo, yeah, we'll stick one right there. Good, and the chicks can sleep together or something. I don't know. I'm not, it's, not, it's not pervy. It's just realistic, you know, kind of. I want to sleep with my lady. Can I afford this? I can, but it's kind of too big. Maybe we shouldn't, like, we shouldn't sleep in the same bed, you know, that'd be a little, like, a little too early in the relationship to sleep in the same bed, maybe. How do I turn this around? Ah, okay. Um, I feel like we're, we really have a hostel right here, just random fucking shit. Okay, maybe I can put a roof? Uh, that's a stupid place for a bed, because it's gonna rain. Uh, but no, I kind of like my little balcony thing. Alright, fine. I will just put that there. And then we'll get one more. And perfect. Alright, you're welcome. I just renovated my house to have all these guests. Okay, cool. Fucking fantastic. I like it. It's good. Alright, you, you bitches. Uh, I mean, you wonderful, lovely ladies. Uh, wait. <coughs> where are you going? Where where are you going? Please tell me you're not going out for a smoke this late at night. It's dirty. What? Oh, are you... Are you crazy? Maybe we should, maybe we should talk to her. Special. We should give her some. We should give her some of my charisma. Yeah, yeah. We should admire her. Tell her that we like some things about her, and then great kiss her. Cause I'm. Yeah. Fuck it. We'll just make out. I've always wanted to make out with someone in the rain. It seems so lovely and so unconventional. Definitely not a Disney cliche type thing. Oh, it's not raining anymore. Are you shitting me? Are you, how the hell are we gonna make out in the rain if it's not? Oh man. Oh, it's fucking midnight. We should. Okay, we should stop making out, man. Oh, no, she's sleeping. So we're not even going to be in, like, the same area together? Are you kidding me? You're supposed to take the bed in there. Wow, what did I just do? I learned that she's an Aries. Oh, perfect. I didn't even mean to learn things about my lover. Yeah, so, um... Hey, I just... I just think you should... You should get some flowers. I can't afford them, but you're worth it, babe. You are so worth it, Ariel. My God, just don't tell Seabass. And, uh... You know what? A massage. Fucking chicks love massages. <coughs> yeah, that's right. Just, just work out the kinks in her back. She likes you, man. She likes you. She definitely does. Now we gotta go to bed. 
All right, I'm gonna go to sleep. So I'm extremely irresistible. I'm gonna evil slumber. Don't tell anyone about it. Okay, now, no. Look, I, I know. I thought she was went to school for the gifted. She can't even figure out how to open the door. Damn it. Where is she going? Please don't burn the house down. I please don't want her to be retarded. Come on, come on. Oh, is she, is she able to sleep? We are totally not spying on her while she takes a shit. That would be rude. Oh, and she broke the fucking toilet bowl. She takes 10 pound shits. Okay, can she get in there? Oh, shit. That was a dumb place for a bed. All right, all right. I don't want to get cranky. She's going to get cranky, and she's going to leave. And then, just like that, I don't have a girlfriend roommate anymore. All right, all right, fine. I, I can't put her outside. That'd just be rude. Um... All right, hold on, hold on. Fucking just, just chill there for a second. I'm not, I'm not getting rid of you yet. A lamp? What where the hell can I put this lamp? God damn it, this lamp makes no fucking sense. I don't even want this stupid lamp. Fuck you, I don't even want the lamp. I put the bed here. Perfect. All right, now, Ariel, it's not difficult. Just fucking go to bed. Just, just go to just sleepy sleep, okay? Sleepy sleep. Look, it's right. Ar Ariel, come back. Ariel Walsh, you. You come back here right now, and you go to bed. Why couldn't you wear something less for bed? Why do you have to wear something very respectable? I feel like she's the one, but I don't know. I, I don't know if I should go steady with her or not. I feel like I should still, like, you know... I should talk a little bit, but she's, she's dreaming of love. Oh, she's dreaming of me. Oh, Ariel. Oh, what yonder eyes set forth upon my beautiful ass. For Juliet is the east, and Ariel is the west. And when one gives un- What? It's Crosby dog, stupid dog. I'm just saying, maybe she wants to have sex. There's no way we're having sex in this bed. You're dreaming about broken things. Wait a second, what the hell's going on here? Oh, is that the Hammonds? No, 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 no. Rajan's going home. We're gonna fucking- We should fuck up Rajan's home. We should- We should do some shit. Oh, good, I'm in a good mood. Nothing could take me down. Except the fact that I have- Work tomorrow. Oh, fuck. Well, this is the internet. We gotta try and keep a committed relationship, which is rather difficult. We gotta work, which is rather difficult. We gotta become a mastermind, not break her heart, possibly sleep around. I like her. She, Ariel's kind of cute. She's not a Kate, and she's not a Molly, but she's kind of cute. What the hell? Who are? Who are? Who? What's your mama? Who's your mama? I can't stop this. <laughs> feel like she's foreign as well. Malayla. Oh, baby, Malayla, show me where you are on the map. You're in my bathroom. Wow. Look at those. Totally not spying, although your face looks kind of bland. You kind of look like a man. You have a very Squidward face. Totally Squidward. But the... Ah! I'm sorry, it's broken. I didn't mean to. Uh, and what about the other chick? I always... Uh, what kind of knockers does she have? Wait, I don't even know why I'm asking these questions. It's very rude. I should I should be having breakfast with my loved one. She's eating horrific, horrifying quality of mac and cheese. That is disgusting. I should clean this house up. I thought, again, I thought she was gifted. If she's eating this stupid shit, have breakfast. <coughs> Fucking, we'll make waffles again. We got this. Fucking, we got this. All right, look, babe, babe, I'll, I'll make you some. She even cleans up after herself. Oh my God. Serve breakfast. Waffle. Why does she dress like a slut? Hold on. Ho ho hold on. I don't know if I pre where are you going, ma'am? Where are you what do you do? What do you do for a living? What I don't I don't understand. I don't what do you do? Oh you take out trash, which is good. No, hold on. This is fucking I, I have to follow her. She owns a jet ski? I don't know. I can't I can't fucking let her get away. I gotta find out what she's doing. We're we're going steady. if she's screwing some guy on the side, I need to know this kind of stuff. This kind of type of stuff. She's going to a fucking foreign island. Fuck is she going? I'm on to you. I'm on to you, okay? You kissed me. I kissed you. We kissed in the rain. You know, that's like ten times more passionate than kissing elsewhere. It's a rain kiss, okay? Nature was was fucking jizzing on me while we kissed. That means something. Where are we going? Where are you going, woman? Are you just like are you trying to escape me? No no no, we're not gonna lose you. Fucking this is like some spy shit. Alright, good. Carpool What? You going to another man? Where are you? Who are you? Fuck. Is this what you do all day? You just drive around doing nothing? Anthony, if the carpool comes, just go. Fucking just go, okay? I know she's a PR person, but I don't think she's going to PR work. I think she's going to PR dick sucking. I can't trust her. Okay, I'm losing her. Lose. Where the fuck is she? Fucking losing her. Alright, follow her, follow her, follow her. Come on. Okay, we're 
Hunting over fish. Oh, she just killed fucking nature. Where is she going, man? Where are you going? Where are you going with your skimpy outfit? Is this, are we back home again? Where the fuck did you do this? Where are we? Oh, fuck, I wish I could read your mind. But no one can read a woman's mind. No one. Well, Mel Gibson could in that one movie, but then he got electrocuted. And then he could no longer read one. Oh, good. Good, we're back on ground. Okay, where are we going? Where are we leading to? This is the traditional I Spy film. Whose dick are you sucking? And I'm going to get it all on candid camera. Yeah, I fucking loved you, okay? There's a heart above our head. Where's the heart above your head right now? It's fucking gone. Shows you how much you care. I'm fucking making waffles. The carpool's going to come pick me up. I don't even care about the carpool. I don't even care about work anymore. And now you have a shitty car? But I collected rent. Where are you going? No, 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 no. Okay, not giving up, not giving up. I need to find, this is fucking I Spy, okay? I'm Tom, what? What is she doing here? What is she doing here? What is this? Is she a pedophile? What is she doing with little children? Why is she dressed up like this for little children? I am very confused. I don't get what she's doing. I, I don't. Is this place? That's in show competition. What the fuck is this place? The fuck is this? What the fuck just happened? The hell just happened to me? I don't like it. I li I'm going to I'm going to fucking work, and we're gonna discuss this when I get home for dinner. We're gonna discuss this as a couple. I'm fucking right in your backyard. I after work I'll just go fucking visit her. You know, fucking just bust my asshole off working hard. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm gonna I'm gonna work hard. Yes, they're gonna get make a lot of- Why are so many women here in this evil clan? Are they trying to say that the most evil people in society are women? Because I don't feel it. I, I know some nice women. Sometimes. It, re it really depends. I'm not playing hopscotch, that's a girly game. I can't afford a dryer. We're doing good. Let's see what happens when we work hard. Hey, I know I'm grungy, I know I'm disgusted, I know I'm germy, I know I'm strained, and I know I'm very hungry, but... Good thing is I'm overworked. Is there any positives to my life currently? Maybe I'll get a paycheck race. My hygiene's shitty. I could die. I could just die during work and then I could sue. <coughs> Although, honest to God, I am confused why she's that at that place dressed as a slut. Which, I'm not saying my girlfriend's a slut. I'm just saying, we're not even boyfriend-girlfriend. My, the one I kiss. The one, I am the one who kisses. I'm not saying she's a slut, but she's kind of, you know, I mean, if you act like a slut and you dress like a slut and you're really friendly, which is a code word for easy... I don't fucking know what I want from this relationship. I do know that I am not gonna make it out alive. I only earned hundred and one dollars. I just okay. I just magically deliciously transferred. It's good. It's good. I need to go. I need to sleep, man. I'm strained. Work is busting my balls. I do like this transporting thing though. That's pretty cool. Uh hey. Do we have other roommates? Yeah, no, don't mind me. I'm not a stranger. I'm just some weird guy. If I can change my hairstyle. I, I got I gotta fix it. Don't worry. Just whoosh, wash. I'm back to normal. Where the fuck are my my weird people? Oh hey Ariel, suck any good dicks recently? Yeah, yeah, that's right. And don't even look at me. I only I know what you do when you're part time. You go to a child's school. I smell bad. I need I need to have some serious fun. Oh, we just go to bed. Let's go to bed. I was keeping you up late. What? What? No. I should ask her on another date, and then we should go. Just sleep. You have a bed, right? And it's your bed. Oh, don't you give me shit. I'm taking a shit. I had a long, hard day, okay? It was rough. I I stole candy from two babies. And after that, I peed. And it was a nice pee. Now you're going to bed. It's fucking... You're doing drugs. You're sucking dick. It's 5.08. Who goes to bed at 5.08? I'll tell you who. Floozies. That's right. Professional goddamn floozies. Alright, well, we're gonna wrap it up here for now. I have to, It's 2.20 in the morning. I need to go and clean and actually get ready for packs. So that was The Sims. Shit's unraveling. The roommate idea is really good. Really makes things interesting. Although I am a little nervous about what's gonna unfold between me and Ariel. I may just sleep with her best friend. I mean, fucking... Why not? Or we'll just have a couple of more roommates come into the house. I don't know, seven girls. That could be one hell of a party. I'm not into that. I am a respectable, wholesome guy. Yeah, you don't believe that for a second.